And then welcome back to Songs of Six. So, things are moving on. We are currently waiting on furniture, which should hopefully be solved by the uh, new carpenters up here. We've got some injuries, but of course they'll be fixed by the apocryphy, the physician. Who are currently doing their best. Just seeing what they need. Drop to zero, so we're about to get back into positive four. Operation. Various eateries are all being heavily used. Except for this canteen. We got food going out for people. Minus four for jobs now. We're building up a nice supply of coal, so let's reduce that down and free up a few workers. That's going up nicely. to make yourself happy. Still the bath houses. The baths are quite a heavy weight towards happiness. Leisure time. Maybe we might get some leisure stuff out for them. A stage or something. I need a bigger graveyard actually. Rolls have filled up quite rapidly. How about say how much that is interfering with your love life? Have cheese is good, healthcare is good. Stages and arenas are gradually too high. Yeah, graveyards are at zero. Good faith as well, so a temple and a graveyard. Okay, we're not doing that way. Uh, wrong tap, that's why. gap in between these two. Let's do a mass grave in all but name. Yeah, 
they can line down here the smaller trees. Lots of flowers. Moved out rather than in. Let's add quite a bit more actually. Only at forty percent um Yeah, we're only at forty percent forty eight. Okay, now it's not gonna be too bad. That's how I filled these in. Twenty four per cent. A bit of space up here we can grab as well. percent extend the graveyard yeah that's fine hey actually working on the lab now oh, we're up on rations apparently people happy yet. I pushed towards 500 for this week. And having eight people able to work though it slows down construction quite a lot. Everything. Oh, we're gonna need more wood, apparently. Let's clear out this section here. Down here. Making the bathhouse here. Right, the bathhouse doesn't get 60 odd people. That's well, just finished. Oh, this would put a Can you not drain my entire population, please? But again, there's a lot more work. I need an asylum, a lot of people are getting deranged in my town. We'll see a population boom in a minute.
Yeah, it's just shortage of wood. Oh, metal as well. Could I build a tool maker? Not a carpenter. One very, very bad beetle core thing. Nineteen. Do I build a tool maker down here? Do not unlock that. Do you think wood? That's producing a good stop out of fish. We've got a good stop out of most foods actually. I am happy with that. Operations up to 18 spare. to order them to clear out some more rock. That's the edge of the map up there, so we have to sneak down here. Somebody else got themselves injured. Still plenty of spare homes, so these people are just being silly. Can I order the import of gems? Jumps and tools when you switch back to metal. You don't have anywhere to store tools. Yeah, we did have tools, they just weren't being stored. I'm not using masses at the moment. Although they are used to make workers faster. The number of people at the graveyard is slightly worrying. But they work a mausoleum system where they take someone up every few years. Right, four more grave diggers. See how many of these get filled up immediately. Bit of you will need homes, but everything is green for these. So they're just odd jobbers. Probably why they've not chosen a home. Right, we have got enough for our bath now. There we are, it's 1,800. So I can stick more people into here. More people into here. Still have a floating population. out the boom time. How oh, my toilet's doing? Need a secondary toilet in town, I think. Um, the, crop, the fields are being made ready for next year. Like walls, please. Thank you very much. And a door in here. With lots of latrines.
bathed in enough. I'm not going to stick another toilet in there. Not quite. Got 23 spare people. That should mean this would go in quickly. What 1k knowledge. Riding quite nicely now. It's minus 30 at the moment, but luckily everyone's got access to homes. Even if it's not taking them. And they're looking quite good, actually. Got a little stock out of furniture, pottery, clothing. We might need more tailors. The masonry. Copter, copter. Yeah, another tailors might be a useful idea. A lot of people going around the back here. Getting to here, so. And if we bring this up like this, and then hook along here to connect back into this road. Now I can fit a couple of things into here. Yep, someone else got injured. Someone starved in it. Oh, good. What, what do you see all the way over there? No wonder you starved in it. storage for yes we have storage for animals which is not producing much coal's coming nicely oh it's here this next yeah tailor down work crafting tailor because at some point I've got to make better armor Just fill this entire area in with a tailor. It'll just look neater. It's almost the perfect size. Just need to put a pillar in here. There's a nice long workbench in here. Should be Very long foot. Auxiliary stations along this wall. There. And some doors in here, and some doors in here. Yeah, that's a bad place for doors, because that's blocked. And we've got almost enough to build that as well. Someone immediately gets wounded. And... Yeah, I'm not sure why we've got people starving to death on this island. Turn it's off and running. And loads of very, very constipated villagers are going to go relieve themselves. It's still a major shortage, apparently. Let's strip that and then take this second. You, you're getting a load more workers. Oh, you put steady trickle of wood. Now I need to start thinking about more housing. 
these are all filling up now. This is kind of an industrial area. Another row of houses. Along here. What's the council job? to accept that. Alright. Let's we'll see how quickly these fill up. The bakery is already overloaded. Grains and we have coal. Oh, 1.7, so very close to the bathhouse. So these houses are now empty, apparently. Hopefully, they can keep hovering. I think we're losing some of the, like, the dwarves and stuff like that. We're rapidly becoming a mainly human population. I would love to put more people into the uh, stone mine. But population dip. Let's turn off the alarms for being injured. Can't speak of doing. Looks like he's being pelted by fruit. Um. So what is people's access to that doing for their health? We're getting enough sports, getting enough news, stages and arenas. They will be next up after the bathhouse. Next time it pops up, we'll have to actually cancel it. Alright, the new tail is up, that's where most of the work went. 198, come on. Push up. Being clothes will be a thing that you can actually get hold of and that'll make everyone happier. I see people getting wounded in my town all the time. Right, food days will go up now because the... There we go, I am mayor. Which is a point zero high happiness. And I need... ability apparently. Things looking pretty good. More mushrooms. I do have some more mushrooms. Got a bit of an excess population already. Which is good because I'm about to start up the next building process. How's it is? It's not one in here. It won't be very big. Let's see where I wanted to put one earlier, but I may have built in it. Found the hunters. I don't need to be its own building. I just have to go down here. 
All those tree lands we got anyway. Yeah, let's interrupt the houses. Don't have to be wooden. Like avoiding regular blocks if possible. Doesn't feel very medieval. These bits are neatly in the corners. take a while to construct because you know we need more stone and metal well, actually the cut stone's fine it's... let's increase the number of workers in here that will give everyone happy jobs The 16 scientists are working away. Hey, the first next metal, metal shipment just came in. Perfect. Two more of those, and we'll be able to actually afford to get this done. But no gems come in. Do we have a stockpile for gems? Maybe we've had gems come in and we've just not had a stockpile for them. No. There's the option of building a little gem mining house down here. These are my hunters, I assume, going out into the wilds. Well, they steal from the um, collect as much opiates as possible. I think they are, yeah. 31 spare people. Bunch of spare houses, so I'm not too worried. Let's rack up the wood gutter. And mason jobs. Good of our stockpiles of the important stuff. Didn't mean I got fully stopped that wood put a would have done that before building the second one. Food is okay, we definitely need that new milk mushroom patch though. That's a fairly cheap thing to build. I'll have to dig into the mountain first. Right. Digging the mountain, there we go. I can just continue that like that. There you go, my little workers. Give me a massive mushroom cave. Okay. Half is something I've not been building up much of. Roads is good. Building skink. Better roads would actually probably boost up everything. Don't have the stone for it though. Light might help. I think I'm still better off going for entertainment. Let's see what we can get. A stage. I've never built a stage before, so let's see what they can get. Not 
now we have all that. It's just that. Okay. That's actually pretty on this side of the bathhouse. Billion. Oh, okay. Yeah. What I actually want to do is build up a civilian down there. Build a dirt road around it. Enough stone. This will hopefully do my next bout, bout of population boom. Do I need to get to to get the next population? Chieftain, a thousand people. Lots of administration, and f yeah, the need for more nobility. At that point, I will have to pick up gem mines. What's gem mining costing? 1,100. A little house in town to support it wouldn't be a bad thing. Let's save for that, shall we? Yeah, we had everything we needed for the stage. Well, that's, that's proper... Gordy. It's probably going to dry a huge chunk of my population in a sec. But we're seeing happiness rise across the board. Wait, I'm planning my next batch of apartments, I think. Yeah, we'll do it down here. I fit in. No, I don't want to buy any of your slaves. This is going to be massive overkill. Let me sit down to worry about the ones who want privacy for a while. We are getting further and further away from Jobs Central, so I'm going to have to build some jobs down here. Let me have a shortage of clay. Like down like that, so we don't have to worry about it. How's your happiness now? Services, stages is at twenty percent, but rising rapidly. Arenas, drinky services. happy. Food rations, food preference is average. They want jewellery. There's 48% on that. Religion could be a useful one. Your time age is always a good way, but we're not at that stage yet. Law. Law would be a nice one to pick up. It costs to go into law. Well, 
Temples, tombs, torches will be 300. Lighting will be a good one. Rest home, arena, justice. Okay, city guard. That's what I'm needing next. 400. Let's boost the speed of getting that coming in. We just slot the city guard in around here somewhere. You know, like this eatery is really badly placed. And work within its radius. Okay, that's important to know. So we don't need that anymore. We should probably dismantle the whole structure. That's, that's going to be much more useful for something else. We've finally eaten all the animals in rage. Oh. How's our new guardhouse? Going to be. Infrastructure, military. Oh, we've got access to a dungeon as well. That looks like a good place for a guard post. Down there. Then let's build ourselves a dungeon. There's been a lot of brawling going on. The dungeon can move to fill in this space here a bit more efficiently. Say that, but it's not a great building, is it? Honestly, that's 32 prisoners. That should be massive more than we need. We shrink that down like that. Or up there. Lower, but we need a guard post down south, don't we? That's a dead area, otherwise. Okay. Not getting gems, could you bring it armor? Do we need yet another tailor to be making makeshift armor? But the bathhouse is up, so we should see a large boost in population. Yeah, let's go out making a makeshift weapon sector down here. That's where my nobles are going to be. Let's expand this southern town out a little bit more. If we like a tailor in here. Get that down one. The door in. Extend it one. Just to get in a bit more efficiency. Yeah. And the 
such demand on metal. Hopefully we'll get a load imported. Let's whack some more clay workers. Because clay is still running short. One in further or Just on the off chance we got some more knocking around. Food days are dropping, so we're going to need some more fields. Now we're expanding this bit. Let's see what we're short on. A bit more fruit. Fruit there. Got the turnip veg. That other mushroom farm is what we need. Green's good. Maybe another bakery actually. Down across this way apparently. To there. Bring this up as a two road along here. Hopefully that will get them going down there. Got 62 unworking people now. I can properly crank up my research rate. There's like a general food boost, isn't there? Food optimization for 200. Which gives a 10% boost to everything. Marvis is coming in. They're still working slowly but surely to clear out the insides there. There's empty houses. Obviously, this is for the massive worker section of mobile workers. It's up to 50 again. Let's crank this all the way up to the top. Population is rising. I need a second bathhouse already. Let's continue with our plans to make this place. I still got available soon, so. Let's sneak one in behind the houses here. with some benches in for some relaxation. Door here. Again, needs metal. Lack of metal is going to really hurt. Let's see what I want to build my new bakery. What I can do is give them 100% workload to begin with, if that helps. Go 
an auto reply, that's fine. Stone mark workers. Probably going to be lack of canteens as well that's causing issues. That'd be better as a major canteen. So yeah, I think it would be so. Defeat room. Then. Out of structure. It's just annoying me if taking up a huge chunk of room on the other side. We're just going to strip it down and we're going to come in and we're going to see what's going to build us a nice stone eatery. Or, what are my chances of unlocking Tavern? Now, was that a mistake? Because do I also need a brewery? I do, so I have to wait for the brewery. So this will be the eatery for now. Open the canteen. Gonna eat up all that space there. Eat what's left. Present tables, let's see if we can fit another cooking station. Let's actually just make one very large, two large cooking stations down here. Let's see how many tables we can fit in. Thousand percent tables. That'd be another thirty-two services. But again, metal. I need a door. My metal shortage is going to be crippling me. As is my shortage of housing, apparently. Right. So we need more houses down here. That's a certain. Who wants like gridded streets? Me yeah, anyway. It's down there, yeah. Let's extend this road around. But it hooks back in with this road here. Just need so much metal. Anything else I can export to get metal? The money. Exporting that. Let's export rations. Export a ton of rations because that's about all we seem to be mass producing. I put another grain field down as well.
There you go. The fruit farm. Nine days, but it is autumn, so that should be going up soon. Bed is just still not keeping up. So another baker is needed. I feel like I've got enough metal needing um, projects on the go. You can apparently buy stuff for this, so... What would it cost to actually just buy the metal straight in? I 13 metal. Thirty is already about. Yeah, look at that, it's just nowhere near what you need. They are trading for it, it's just taking for a long time. Now we're just going to be running the clock for a bit, I guess. Another way for houses is needed. Leave that as a street. That should be plenty. Having individual houses instead of the dormitories just take a lot more space, which is good. In armor for the law, house my metal for my dungeon, metal for my canteen. Far. Getting up to the top of the map here, so I'm not going to be expanding this far much more now, further north. Get quite a large fruit farm. That produces a thousand a year. Point three K in tech. Safe roads, boilage improvement. The gem mine. They're a trading one. Maintenance, trade negotiations. There's trade points in trade browse, go if you double your sale pitch. Right. So we're now trading at 30% improve improvements. Need to workplace safety seems like a good buy at this point. Should unlock massive armor. Lamps up soon. Any slaves? Do have an army of 105 then? Any housing under control now? Apparently, all just wants to live up here. This is, this is where the work is.
Okay, the canteen has got enough stuff to be constructed. That will give a boost to happiness. Also, probably drain my food supports last night, which I dropped down to six. Drop. Bear in mind, it's down a fair chunk. Give us population to get this new canteen up and running, which is immediately swamped. Okay, so we can get metal for that, gems for that, metal for that, and metal for that. This canteen is doing okay. Six days of food is a bit worrying, but I've got a new field under construction as soon as you have to pay people to build it. Likewise, I need a mushroom farm to go down here, and then I'll probably save up for the time. I'll probably have to gather a bunch of wilds. Okay, you're just blocking that off, are you? There's your door. Good for your mushroom and some food, that's fine. Obviously, wild animals, just mushrooms. Anywhere on the map. Like food wise, we're not going to be short. Let's just set that to all and just. Strip mine this area here. That'll massively boost the food stores. If we end up with too much stuff, it'll get sold. We've got too much furniture apparently. Are we exporting furniture? We are not. Let's switch over to exporting furniture. Everything over 500 gets sold because I've got a good sell price. Metal price is crashing, thankfully. But yeah, it's still been on for an hour. So, thanks very much for watching. I will see you all next time. Give me a like if you can.